Good morning, my dear students. Today we are going to discuss about the first chapter that is your number system. But before starting the number system, we must know about the basic concept of number system. Most of the students they are confused between digit and number. So first, let me clear you what is a digit and what is a number. So digit. Is the sim digits are the symbols generally in mathematics generally we have 10 symbols you can see here the 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 these all are mathematical symbols and these symbols are called digits these symbols are called digit and then what is number so number when we are going to write a single digit or a set of digit that we that is representing a number so you can write in this way number can be represented by one or more digit for example you can see 9 is a single digit 10 having two digits so we can say 9 10 135 are the examples of numbers then further we must know about classification of number it is very important to know about classification of number so number is further classified into the category real number and non-real number or imaginary number we can say we are going to discuss about real numbers real number are further categorized into rational number and irrational number these two numbers are there in your labels so we are going to discuss these two later but before that we must know about the rational numbers so rational number is further divided into these categories this is natural number whole number integer fraction even number odd number then prime number composite number and last is coprime number first we are going to discuss about these all numbers then we can start our topic that is number system so let's start with the natural number all the counting numbers are called natural number they start from 1 and example is 1 2 3 4 and so on all the natural number are positive you can see here I did underline so it is very important to know they are all are positive now what are the whole numbers so whole numbers are all the natural number including 0 are called whole numbers 0 1 2 3 4 and so on they are also all positive then next category is integers integers are all positive as well as negative including 0 you can say these are called integers so I have given an example 4 3 2 minus 1 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 are integers then fraction in general we can say a number which we can represent in the form of a upon b where v is not equals to 0 that is your fraction then even number the number which are divisible by 2 are called even number and these are 2 4 6 8 and so on they are even number odd number odd numbers are in which which are not divisible by 2 they are odd number like 1 3 5 7 9 are odd numbers then we must know about prime numbers so in general we can say prime numbers having two factors one and itself then composite number composite numbers are the number other than one which are not prime are called composite number that means we can factorize them then coprime numbers coprime numbers two natural numbers are coprime when there is no common factor between the two number except one so you can take an example two and five you can see in two and five there is no common number so we can call them coprime numbers so you need to cover up to here and tomorrow on we will start with the net your topic that is rational number and irrational number thank you